everybody, I'm Reagan Locri, and we're here with Dr. John Frangi today. How are you today? I'm well, Reagan. How are you? I'm good, thank you. So we're going to talk a little bit about LASIK today. Which problems does the LASIK treat? The LASIK treats any of the problems that cause a decrease in distance vision. So if you need glasses for driving, going to the movies, things like that, that's what LASIK treats. So does LASIK hurt? LASIK doesn't hurt. It's surprising because the eye is so sensitive, but we use medications so that what the patient is aware of, it feels like I may be resting my thumb on your eye, but as you found out when you've had it done, it isn't a painful procedure. No, it's definitely not. I actually was probably the most easy procedure I've ever had and super worth it. Um, but so have you had it yourself? I have. I have. A number of years ago, about 15 years ago, I had LASIK done and we had, I had the no blade procedure done as well and I love it. So how old do you have to be to get LASIK done? LASIK can't be done in anyone younger than 18 and we often find that <clears throat> Even at 18, patient's vision is still changing. So we want you to be at least 18 years old with a stable refraction. And that means that your eyeglasses aren't continuing to get stronger every year that you see your eye doctor. So as long as your eyeglasses and contact lens strength is the same and you're over 18, it's usually very safe. So does your practice use a blade when doing LASIK? So Reagan, we haven't used a blade in over 25 years. Uh, we were among the first practices in the country to use the intralase, which is the no blade system, and we're the only greater Springfield area practice that continues to do the no blade technology. Thank you so much for all of that useful information. I really appreciate it. You are welcome. Thanks for coming out, and I'm glad that you've had such a good experience with your LASIK procedure. Yeah, thank you. I am too. For all of you at home, if you want more information, you can head to johnfrangimd.com.